Global Education Media presents Education Report on TV, a television program that promotes educational events and activities across the country for parents, students, practitioners in educational fields across categories, corporate organizations, with products and services that appeal to the youths, government officials, particularly those saddled with the responsibility of managing education and the general public. It also covers programs and activities in the educational sector, such as awards and opening ceremonies, school into house sports, collaborative engagement with NGOs, as well as corporate organizations, plus vocational and technical education, institution for people with special education needs, individual contribution towards the growth and development of education while celebrating success in the educational sector at all levels. For sponsorship and advert placement, please contact 0803-323-2771 or 0812-120-1359. Education Report on TV. Promoting excellence in education on television nationwide. It is said that the youths are the leaders of tomorrow. Consequently, to prepare these future leaders for the task ahead of them, the National Women Coalition on AIDS, now WACA, Lagos State Chapter, organized a seminar for the changed champion students in the state. With the theme, Leadership and Health Monitoring Program for Senior Secondary School Students in Lagos State. The event, which was interactive in nature, gave room for the participants to share and learn new ideas while discussing topical issues that affect them. One at the front is the leader, and the others were able to follow because he's leading them to a nice way and changing them positively. The one at the front, there's a big, there's a gap in between the one at the front and the others which are following him, which means that the one at the front is the leader, and which he said in a tree in which the others are to follow him and they are taking they are almost taking the same step towards the person at the front which is the gap in between. The two things there, there's a gap, which means that, that the penguin in front is ahead of others. Second point, the leader is always ahead of others. It will be one step, it will be many steps, but a leader will always be ahead of others. The um, diagram shows that a penguin and the penguin has um, other followers. So the followers are taking step because it's taking them to somewhere they never knew about and it's the only person that has the idea of where it's going to be. It's getting more interesting. Leaders always have followers. Leaders have followers. Sometimes when people say to me, I'm a leader, I'll say, there's a, there's a particular host. If you look back and there's nobody following you, then you are just taking a walk. With the penguin in front, there's a sort of confidence in the way he's walking, as if he knows where he's headed. And the others following him, they are kind of not sure of where they're going. Leaders are confident. Leaders are sure about where they're going. I think in what she said, the leader has confidence, but at the same time, he's willing to take the risks that is ahead of him that he might know or he might not know. Why the others are just feeling reluctant to go? Because if there is any risk, they might end up running back. That's what makes him believe. Leaders are courageous, they are risk takers, and also they bear the burden of leading the people whether it's in the right direction or the wrong direction, has to take responsibility for the other six headwinds. The president of SMILE, Mrs. Binkbe Bangbushi, spoke on the qualities of a transformational leader. Can we read this quote together, please? This is the definition of a leader that I want you to grow up with. Wherever you find yourself in life, you should aim to do what? Inspire people around you to do what? Dream more, learn more, and become, do more and become more. Those should be your targets. Leadership is not about title. It's not about wealth. It's about positive influence. And passion is very, very important. Okay? It supplies all the energy that you need to drive that force. So tell the person next to you, don't be tired of being a change champion. Don't be tired of being a change champion. Come to another person. Don't be tired of being a change champion. You must be seen and you must surround yourselves with the right people.
people. You might be trying to make friends with somebody because you want to help them get better. If their own influence will be on you, it will be more than your influence on them. Abuse of power. A lot of people, when they taste small power, small position, they begin to abuse that power. If you are put over people, no matter what they do to you, pass on money, maybe the person has helped you before, and now the ball is in your court. Please, for God's sake, not my sake, find it to be your heart, not to use that power to do what is not right. Highlight of the day was the talk on violence given by some members of the Change Champion group. There must be peace in Africa. There must be peace all over the world. Let us put violence to shame. the students broke into various groups where they continued their discussion on leadership. Golden Penny Semovita is fortified with nourishing vitamins and contains fiber for easy digestion. Our low fat and high protein content with easily digestible carbohydrates makes for the perfect family meal. Golden Penny Semovita. Share our secret. Now available in new attractive packs. As a mother, I always try to ensure my family has a great day. And it starts with Golden Penny Pasta. At work, it gives my husband the energy to be outstanding at what he does. For me, <laughs> it gives me the vitality to face the challenges of the day. And when my kids do their thing, they're the star attraction. Let your family stand out from the crowd. Give them Golden Penny Pasta. Golden Penny Pasta, my family's choice. The Lagos State Schools Debate is a yearly event organized by the Lagos State Ministry of Education with the aim of improving the intellectual capacity of students in Lagos State and also to instill in them the act of public speaking. This year's edition, which was the fourth edition, was held at the Lagos Television Blue Roof and had in attendance important dignitaries from the education sector, among whom were the Commissioner for Education, Mrs. Olayinka Oladunjoi, the Special Advisor to the Governor on Education, Education, Otumba Fatai Olukoga, the Chairman, Lagos State House Committee on Education, Honorable Alawuye, and the Special Advisor to the Governor on Commerce, Mr. Sheye Oladejo. The Commissioner, in our address of welcome, spoke on the achievements of the Lagos State Government in the education sector, and she also appreciated the technical consultants who have supported the program so far. It's very important to let you know that our students are taking ways in both national and international competitions. And we are indeed very proud of them. This can be linked to the massive transformation that is taking place in our public schools through the provision of conducive environments for quality te teaching and learning. Ladies and gentlemen, I must tell you that our finalists today have gone through extreme grieving and grieving to achieve and arrive at this stage. It is worthy to know that the 213 schools debate competition. We had three old nine schools participating. Fourteen private schools joined them. Now, at 
the preliminary stages, we had 64 local schools that has emerged. The qualified schools were then groomed by our technical consultants, Regent Hills. Subsequently, we had a round of 32 debaters. Finally, today we have the debaters that we have. Your Excellency, you represented, ladies and gentlemen. The grand finale we are witnessing today features outstanding debaters and speakers. To examine the first and second positions, Redland Senior Grammar School is for Mojai District 1. We started out with the Senior Middle College in District 2. Why is the Senior Middle College in District 2? We love points in Badagi Senior Grammar School in District 5. Finally, let me also express our gratifying appreciation to all our technical consultants who we cannot divorce from our success story. Thank you very much for your support and contributions. I want you all to sit back and enjoy our children as they speak and entertain us. Students then took turn to speak on various topics as stated by the moderators in various categories.